Hello everyone, I'm Frank Fu. Welcome back. Today, we will dive deep into comparing the latest real-time API models, helping you understand their features, performance differences, and the most suitable use cases. In terms of model architecture, GPT-40 real-time preview uses the basic architecture, while subsequent versions have been progressively optimized. For example, the 2024-1217 version uses the latest optimized architecture, further improving speech generation quality and processing efficiency. Uh, the lightweight version reduces costs uh, by simplifying the architecture suitable for scenarios with lower performance requirements. Uh, this is my input. Latency is a key metric for real-time speech interaction. GPT-40 real-time preview has a latency of less than 500 milliseconds, while the 2024-1217 version reduces the uh, latency to below 20 milliseconds, providing a smoother interaction experience. The lightweight version also controls the latency within 500 milliseconds, suitable for scenarios where real-time performance is not critical. In terms of speech quality, GPT-40 real-time preview already provides high-quality speech generation, while the 2017 version achieves the highest level. The lightweight version has slightly lower speech quality, but still close to GPT-40's level, suitable for cost-sensitive scenarios. In terms of features, all versions support voice activity detection, uh, well D, and interruption functionality, but the later versions have optimized those features. For example, the 2024-1217 version further enhances multi-language support and noise operation capabilities, making it suitable for international applications. Additionally, the 2024-1011 and 2024-1217 uh, versions support WebRTC, suitable for scenarios requiring real-time audio and video interaction. Cost is an important consideration when choosing a model. GPT-40 real-time preview has a higher audio input cost, while the 2024-1217 version reduces the cost by 60%. The lightweight version has the lowest cost, especially the 2024-1217 lightweight update, where the audio input cost is only one um, tenth of other versions, making it ideal for large-scale deployment. So, which models are best suited for which scenarios? GPT-40 real-time preview, suitable for scenarios requiring high speech quality, such as voice assistance, uh, real-time translation, and customer support. GPT-40 real-time preview 2024-1217 suitable for high-cost performance speech interaction, customer support, and real-time translation tools. GPT-40 mini real-time preview suitable for basic voice assistance and simple customer support. GPT-40 mini real-time preview 2024-1217 suitable for mobile applications and basic customer support, especially in the cost sensitive scenarios. In summary, if you need the highest uh, speech quality and the lowest latency, GPT for uh, real-time preview 2024 KPL 17 is the best choice. If you are more focused on cost, a GPT for mini real-time preview 2024 or to be 17 offers the best cost performance ratio. That's all for today's video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.